Maybe some of you are saying this right now. I'm sorry for what I said when it was 109 outside or 104. <laughs> Hasn't reached 109 yet, but 104 yet. is close enough. Close enough. <laughs> Eric Coleman reshared this viral picture on the Idaho Weather Watchers Facebook page. This cake really says it all. Yes. Yeah, to everybody out there, my friends, family, all y'all, Rachel especially, I'm sorry for what I said. <laughs> When, <laughs> when it got hot, but it's gonna get yeah. hot today, so I'm probably gonna be mean again today. I'm sorry. Yeah. Get her a cake. Get Rachel a cake. Yes. I will take it. a cake and give Justin a wide berth, apparently. Yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, don't go near Justin when it's 104. I know. I will take the blame for the heat this week if I get the credit also for next week's cool down that's coming in. How about that? So, this was yesterday, a little snapshot of our Tuesday afternoon. We hit 104 in Boise and Ontario. No records were set yesterday, but we might change that today. So, anyone keeping track or up to nine triple digit days in Boise so far this summer? I think today we'll make 10 and we may add one more more tomorrow. So that number might be in the double digits by the time this week is over and done with. Remember the hottest we've been so far in Boise is 105. That's happened twice. We hit 104 yesterday and we've seen 103, 102 and 101 a couple of times as well. So this is not unheard of for this point in the month of August. But remember, typically we are around 91 degrees for the first day of school. So well above average today. And yes, this would be a new record. The current record high for August 16th is 103 degrees. So unsurprising, we continue our heat advisory for Southwest Idaho today. It is going to be almost dangerously hot. If you work outdoors, if you have to spend an extended amount of time outdoors this afternoon, please use caution and please do not walk your four legged family members in the heat of the day. Those sidewalks get too hot for those dog paws. Do it this morning or later this evening. So high pressure remains very solidly in control for the next couple of days. But by Friday, we start seeing some changes. Cooler temperatures come in. We have an area of lower pressure off the coast of California that will start pumping more monsoon moisture our way. So by as early as tomorrow evening, Thursday evening, there's a possibility of a couple of stray thunderstorms and showers as we roll this ahead to tomorrow afternoon. Magic Valley, 3 to 4 o'clock. You might have a couple rumbles of thunder and some sprinkles and then maybe 9 to 10 o'clock tomorrow night in the Treasure Valley. Our first round of active weather. Not all that active, just a slight chance. And we'll see those storm chances continue to ramp up over the weekend as the temperatures start to drop, which sounds Welcome, right? Here's a look at the Magic Valley today. We'll see mid to upper 90s, possibly a triple digit or 